What's up everyone, I'm Bourbon. Um, I'm going to show you how to do uh, create a vault in Diablo 3. So this is Diablo 3. We're going to go into our inventory. You're going to take a puzzle ring that you've got. Um, you've captured it from one of the drops. You're going to take your puzzle ring, you're going to deposit it in here. Once you click transmute, this is going to turn into a portal. This is going to turn into the portal to the vault where there's lots of money and gems. Um, the puzzle ring is great if you need more gems to help boost your guy. Um, also, if you find an ancient puzzle ring, there will be a lot of goblins. Make sure you have some help and some friends, depending on which torment you're in when you pop this. Um, I'm in torment 16. I'm going to go ahead and pop this in and do it. And then you guys can hang around for a little bit of gameplay if you want. Um, or you can continue on. I'm making really short tutorials. Hope this is helpful. If you like it, please subscribe. Let me know if you need anything else. All right, we're going to the portal. Let's go. Here we go. I'm going to buff up my wizard here because he sucks. He's a glass cannon. And we're going to get lots of money. See all the gold popping? There's a goblin. Uh, let's get rid of that. See the gems that are falling? Oh, the goblin ran away. Where'd he go? He's right there. Don't let him go away. Come on, mirror image. Kill. All right, all right, all right, all right. There he goes. He popped. Oh, he drops a little bit of everything. And usually, when it's an ancient, there's a lot of a lot of uh, goblins in here. So, give that a try. Also, if you want to see all the items on the ground after you've uh, waited, just hit Alt on your keyboard. That'll make them all appear. Uh, anything that's breakable in the vault is worth money or has some money or gems inside of it, so make sure you get that. There we go, another goblin. Treasure goblin. Kill him, kill him. What's this? Oh, there you go. You dropped some good stuff. Probably nothing good for me, but that's okay. Oh, I died. This is why I also don't ever play a hardcore character. Never ever. So see how it's not showing up if you hit alt? You can see the things that are on the ground. Oh, my enchantress died. And then once you finish the vault, you've gathered everything you have, you will go meet a boss. Come on, kill the goblin. I like his name is Vault Peon. I'm full. Oh wait, what? He teleported in here? Why are you running? Why are you running, B? Grab some items. If only there was uh, a way to pick up all the materials. Alright, I'm going to show you the boss, man. I'm going to skip over the rest of this. I can. All that, all that's breakable. You get lots of gems. I guess I won't skip over it, actually, because gems are important. Important for helping you level up and get higher greater rifts. Alrighty. And this is... The very fat, ugly man who has lots of money in his little bin and is going to die in one shot. There, he's dead. Alright. See, and then you get a big chest, you get some free stuff. I don't know I have too much crap in here. Oops. And that's it. Vault then closes afterwards, so make sure you gather everything before you get to the boss man. And if you like the video, make sure you come follow me on Twitch. Twitch.tv slash bourbon. It's going to be spelled exactly the same way. I'll put it in the description of the video. Thanks. Bye.